Hey, what is going on, guys? It's me here, the GC, and as you can see, I'm at the Cal Fight Queen layer. So, anyways, um, as you saw in my bank vid, um, I actually showed you a Varax set, and I told you I'd be killing Cal Fight Queen. So let's kill some Cal Fight Queen on vid. And uh, you're probably wondering why I haven't made the vid in like five days. Well, I'm actually sick, like a tonsil infection and a cold, and it's all good though. I'm gonna get back to making more vids, and I'm actually gonna be showing you me killing the Calfight Queen because there are some stuff I need to talk about, and I sh probably shouldn't be talking with this throat. But anyways, let's just pot up, go start attacking it. Uh, okay. So first of all, uh, I actually hit 95 uh, hit points and 79 defense. As you can see, I'm like 56k off uh, the next defense level. And, uh, yeah, so, um, I'm getting 80 defense, and I'm gonna stop there, then at that point, I'll, I'll probably be ready for God Wars. All I would need, oh, that's a nice 49, all I'm gonna need is, uh, my 70 agility, and that should be coming soon. But, uh, yeah, I'll probably camp that in one day, but, for now, let's just get on to killing some Calphite Queen. And if I remember anything else I need to talk about, I'll definitely talk about it. But I'll be showing you the ending of each kill. So, be right back. Okay, so guys, sometimes when uh, you're doing kill fight queen, you need to do two invs. Since you couldn't get the kill in the first one. But lately, like when uh, back in um, the first month of 07, when I was trying out uh, kill fight queen... It would definitely uh, take two ins, but now sometimes I can do it in like uh, in uh, one inf uh, because um, I have like higher uh, stats and stuff. But I did get to a low health on the first inf, so it's not that bad. It's just a matter of luck with your hits, and if Calphite Queen uses Mage instead of Range, and there's the kill. Uh, okay, more wine of Zamorak. So I'll be right back with another kill. Okay, so we're back here, guys, and we're starting another kill. But, yeah, anyways. So, um, let me just quickly go over uh, what's happening in seven days. So, so uh, God Wars Dungeon... Oh, wow, well, that misclick. Okay, so God Wars Dungeon is coming out in seven days. And, as you know, I do have my 83 Slayer. And lately I've been doing some Slayer for fun, but not too concentrating on the power slaying to get uh, my levels up. It's just Slayer, just so I can train combat stats. So, yeah. You do know it's coming out in like, um, in seven days. And I'm definitely going to be camping uh, Spiritual Mages for the first day or two. Or maybe even for the first week, just to get in lots of D-Boots. And I'll definitely be selling my first few pairs. So yeah, I'll be right back with the ending of this kill with more talking. So let's go. Oh, can I make it? Can I make it? Oh, I don't know if I can kill it or not because... Oh, okay. Yes, we got it. And law runes. Okay, that's 20 law runes. And the chances of getting a D-Chain are nil for me because it's never going to happen. I did get a D-Chain once, but it wasn't on here. It was on pre-EOC. And I got it from the second kill, so yeah. But anyways, um, enough for uh, with KQ for now. I'm going to move on to doing a clue scroll on vid for now. And be right back, guys. So here we are guys and we're doing a hard clue scroll and I'm just mixing up random stuff in this vid. Just me doing some Calphite Queen and then now we're doing a clue scroll. Just uh Just for fun. Uh for this vid though. Next vid's probably gonna be specific. But yeah. Just a mix up of random lutations and pretty sure it's thirty-three. Hell yeah it is. Okay. And more coordinates, guys. Let's go do them. And hopefully we can get in some good loot. Okay, so we're there, guys, at the clue location. And let's get it over with. Hopefully this one's the clue. 
uh, this one's the loot, I mean. Okay, come on, let's ramble this Sarah Wizard. Okay. Yeah. Uh huh. Okay. So this one's in Wildy, and I'll get there and be right back. Okay, so let's kill this guy real quick and tell him to give me my loot because I want that third age. And if he doesn't give me third age, then there's nothing I can do about it. It's definitely Jagex's fault. Okay, no, it's not. It's my fault for being unlucky. Oh, well, okay, another clue. And back to Shiloh Village. So, I've had like three or four clues in Karamjo and Shiloh Village just for this clue. And, yeah. But this one's easy. You know, these uh, skulls of redirection from uh, Nightmare Zone, they help a lot since, as you can see, look, I literally, oh, okay, my bad, that, that was, that was 100% my fault. Okay, just a sec. So, okay, there. And, here we are, I'm at Brimhaven already, and all I have to do is walk around and take the cart to Shiloh Village. And I'm gonna go to Shiloh Village, and I'll show you the loot there, guys. Next vid, we go peeking with the bone spear. Lol, yeah, right. Need to hit them fours. Okay. Uh, yeah. Uh-huh. Okay, so I think it's gonna be red bard forever. Oh, no, finally. And... Oh, my lol. Okay, that, that, was, that was cool, guys. That was actually cool. So we got 50 loss, 4.5k coins, and rune plate legs, and nothing else. Okay, I lied. There's a Zami page, guys, and that is worth approximately 500 to 600k, if I'm not mistaken. And that was some pretty cool loot, guys. So, guys, if you enjoyed, and yeah, if you enjoyed and you watched this far, then leave a like and become a GC subscriber. Thank you for watching, and have a nice day.